ACC action in Blacksburg today as Virginia Tech welcomed Florida State to Castle Coliseum. The Hokies and the Seminoles both 13 and 5 entering this game. Seminoles coach Leonard Hamilton going for ACC win number 130 in his career. The Hokies jumped out to an early 10 4 lead. Justin Bibbs in the corner and he sinks the three ball. Then Kerry Blackshear Jr. fakes and drives to the rack. Hokies in control, but not for long. The Seminoles hot from behind the arc. They had six threes in the first half. Phil Kofer hits this one from the wing. Then in transition, FSU knocking down the triple from the top of the key. Hokies trailed by as many as 14 in the second half, but cut it down to five. Justin Robinson led the team with a career-high 26 points. He hits the three. Then Chris Clark added 13, but Florida State too much to handle. They win 91-82. to Eric Johnson has more from Blacksburg. The Hokies started off the game in the right direction, perhaps in the lane leading to a big ACC win, but lackluster defense and foul trouble presented speed bumps and sent Tech on a detour to their second consecutive ACC loss. In the half court, uh, we have to do a better job. Uh, I would be at the front of the list on helping figure out whatever that is to get more consecutive stops. Virginia Tech took high percentage shots in the first half that paid off to the tune of 56% from the field. And with three players on the verge of double figures and only down three at halftime, the road ahead looked promising. But Florida State spread the floor in the second half, which kept the Hokies on their heels. MJ Walker hit 19 second half points for the Knolls. Despite Blackshear and Chris Clark fouling out in the second half, the Hokies had a chance down the stretch to complete a comeback, but couldn't hit the crucial shot. They just had a good run. In the second half, we just we got too spread on defense. We were just giving them open drives to the lane. and uh, We started to change at the end, but it was too late. I think they sped up their like, pace, and we got kind of out of control, stopped playing our game. Um, they started getting like, Easy rebounds, we turn the ball over. I think that was pretty much happening. They start hitting shots and getting hot. There's absolutely no time for the Hokies to lament over this loss as they welcome in North Carolina on Monday night. In Blacksburg, Eric Johnson, 10 Sports.